We're rolling right through another week here, aren't we? We've got to get this thing finished today for that saddle. It's our saddle rockers. So welcome back to FurnitureHowTo.com. Let's get this day started. <laughs> Before we get started on that saddle, finishing that project up, we need to get over here and get this mantle ready for Dave. He's out here sanding. He's going to be doing some staining in a minute. So basically, we just need to get this thing cut to length. They want 52 inches from left to right for this one. So let's get it marked and cut. All right. Like so many other things, Miles, we're just going to cut this with our chainsaw. Then Dave will clean up the ends with that angle grinder. All right, so we got that cut, man. I just got off the phone with a potential customer. I gotta come in here and draw up a quick design. This will be fun. I've actually already talked to these folks a couple of times before and we've been working on this, but I need to refine a design I had, shoot a picture of it and send it to It's a little side table or it could be a little stool. It's 14 by 14, it's overall gonna be 18 up off the ground. Check this out, guys, pretty cool. I'll go ahead and get a picture of that right now and email it to her and see if I can get their approval and then we'll make them four. Send them to Austin. No! College Station, Texas. Let's get this saw. Uh, finish cutting this shelf over here for Dave so he can get it stained. We gotta cut this thing off. Right there and there. So now, we'll get the brands heated up, get these things branded, Dave will be sanding them, and they'll be ready for stain. Let's, let's turn our attention back to our saddle project. We got that frame welded up in there. We just need to come up with a hoop down here where it'll fasten the saddle. So you can see here, I've already taken time to get this hoop made up. It's made out of two inch by three sixteenths strap. We're just gonna take a minute to figure out where we're gonna cut it, and then we're gonna weld it in place right here where we can, where it'll flex. I may not even have to cut it. I may just have to figure out a way to weld it right here, and then I'm gonna put a collar over this so it'll flex in and out. We got this, this little deal set up here. It's hot right now, but it's gonna weld down over this. And then this will be able to hinge the place here and test it, dry fit it before we finish welding it and take it to paint. Check that out. Get that thing over there by that saddle and we'll dry fit it, see how it works. This is gonna work. We'll get it over here. Oh, this one. able to cinch this thing up just like it was on a horse here and I think we're good check it out we've got this set up right here I'm gonna be able to latch it oh yeah that's gonna work guys check it out but we can get right up on here and ride this thing now oh yeah <laughs> all right here take a look and there you go let's see how that's cinched up down there Check it out. Let's get on here and ride this thing. <laughs> Back over there, finish welding it up, and then get it over there to paint.
All right, let's get this thing to paint. Yeah, if we're gonna paint one, we're gonna paint more. So, here you go, we got it all set up to paint. Over here and get this stuff cleaned up. I appreciate you watching like always. Be sure to come back tomorrow and we'll do it all over again. Thanks for watching.